Sasha Banks reacts to Snoop Dogg's AEW Dynamite appearance and splash. Hey there guys, hope you all are doing well. So friends maybe you know about Eminem and Snoop Dogg recent beef or not. But I want WWE to call Eminem on Royal Rumble. Okay, Snoop was there in AEW, let's dig it more. And if you are not subscribed to my channel, go subscribe now, it would take some seconds and would be very fun. Snoop Dogg made his first AEW appearance on the recently concluded New Year's Smash Dynamite episode, and the famous rapper even got physical during the show. Snoop Dogg hit an unimpressive frog splash, aka the Snoop Splash, on Serpentico, before pinning the Chaos Project member for an unofficial win. Snoop Dogg's awkward splash naturally got the fans talking after the show, and his cousin Sasha Banks also chimed in on social media. The SmackDown women's champion hilariously trolled Snoop Dogg on Twitter by saying that his splash needed a lot of work. Here's Sasha Banks' response to the video of Snoop Dogg's splash. She said. Fam. We're gonna have to work on this. Now a question will be, what did Snoop Dogg do on AEW Dynamite's New Year's Smash edition? Snoop Dogg was first seen on Dynamite in a backstage segment that also featured Private Party and Matt Hardy. Snoop had a role to play in Matt Hardy's shot at the WWE, however, the musician's primary role was to be in Cody's corner later on in the night. Cody Rhodes faced Matt Seidel in a singles match, and the former TNT champion made his entrance with a Snoop Dogg remix of his theme song. Snoop Dogg watched the match from the stage area, and he was at his vibrant best throughout the contest. Cody accidentally hit Serpentico who was at ringside during the match, and the angle was explored after the match concluded. Cody picked up the win over Seidel with the crossroads, and Chaos Project attacked the American Nightmare after the match. Seidel and Cody took care of Luther and Serpentico, but it was all a setup for a big post-match moment. Snoop Dogg got involved in the action as he went up to the top rope with Serpentico laid out on the mat. Snoop then unleashed one of the oddest splashes in wrestling history as he didn't fully commit to the landing. Snoop hit the top rope move and Cody completed the three count. While the spot after the match was entertaining, Snoop Dogg does indeed need a few pointers from his cousin Sasha Banks. Snoop Dogg appeared on Dynamite to promote TBF Go Big Show, in which Cody is one of the hosts. There were reports of WWE being unhappy with Snoop Dogg appearing on AEW TV, which coincided with the company removing the joint merchandise of Snoop Dogg and The Undertaker from the WWE shop. While Snoop Dogg could have done a better job with the splash, it was still a fun moment and we'll give him a pass on this occasion. I will see you soon again. Peace out.